I'm sorry, Clark. I mean, it's great staying here with your folks and everything, but I feel so cooped up. On Argo, I dreamed about saving my mother and helping my friends. And now that I have the power to help people, why won't you let me? Listen, I saw a report about Anner Gang on TV, and I thought you could really use my help. Who, me? I'm not in trouble. And by the way, it's Supergirl. See? Super? Girl. So, Queen Bee and Dr. Cyber, not much of a workout. You guys get aboard that mothership and shut down the control devices. Hold off John and the Legion until you snap them back to normal. Tell Ma and Pa I love them. And I love you too, Clark. Don't take this the wrong way, but I've found a place where I can make a difference. Where I'm more than just Superman's kid cousin. I... I feel I belong here. Also, I met this boy. Wow. It seems so unfair to hit these big giant apes when I'm so much stronger than they are. Doomsday clones. Like little baby doomsdays, only not so cute and cuddly. Our school. Are they all dead? Everyone? My father. He's in charge of the mining operations. They'll be after him too. And you're safe here with me. Safe? There's no such thing in Kandor today. I have to warn my father. Father, how could you? Kara, there are many things you do not understand. Understand? I understand you're responsible for bombing Kandor, you and Zod. Oh, I'm so glad to be out of quarantine, I can't tell you. Don't get me wrong, I like the Fortress of Solitude, but you have to admit it is a little boring. Metropolis is much more my style. This is the life I want, Cal. Uh, I mean, Clark. This is how they see you. Bigger than life. You're their champion. These powers. Do you ever regret having them? Not even a little? Can I tell you something? They terrify me. I mean the responsibility. I don't want to be anybody's champion. No offense. Technically, I'm older than Superman. He just got here first. It's a relativity thing. I'm not a scientist. It's hard to explain. It's been hard getting used to Earth. Kryptonian words don't always translate into English. But then again, there's no Kryptonian word for fluffy. I was truly honored the day Superman wanted me to wear this uniform. To become Supergirl. I've spent every day since then trying to earn it. You've spent your whole life on this planet. You grew up with these powers. Do you even remember Krypton? Your parents? My parents? Only a little. Well, for me, it was only several months ago. I didn't have powers. Nobody did. And when bad things happened, we were helpless. Ask regular people down there how they feel when guys like that terrorize them. I have powers now. And I'm going to use them. That's how they found out he was called Brainiac. They learned from his technology. Plan to find him, fight him, get back the people of Kandor. Come on! I've never been invisible before! I want to show Lex Luthor just how secret his secret lair is. With about 50 rolls of TP! Oh, why not? We could stop off in some war torn nation to help striving orphans. Hey, Grundy, didn't anyone ever tell you that the freaks come out at night? I know. Hey, Grundy, where are you headed? To the graveyard to eat some brains! Come on! It'll be fun! But we are equal opportunity butt kickers! Oh, hey, super noob. Where were you a minute ago? Some brainiac went and flipped this lever, this lever right here, and opened all the containment cells. It took me ages to get all the villains locked up again. Honestly, I wish people would be more careful. Oh, come on! Oh, well, here we go again. Did we get him? Boy, the medics are gonna have their work cut out putting all those guys back together. But that's what you get when you try to bust out of jail. A lesson I think we can all learn from. Krypton is gone, but the Earth needs me. My little cousin Cal sees good in everyone. I don't have that problem. Why do you villains keep running? You always get caught. Barbara, don't forget we still have that skiing trip planned when this is over. I'm not gonna lie, Power Girl. Standing here with you feels strange. Zod. 
kneel before Al. When this is over, Doomsday, I'm gonna throw you back into space. That's for my little cousin, Doomsday. Defend your world well and take nothing for granted. I recognize the symbol of Rao. Are you me from a world of magic? Very well. The blessings of Rao be upon you. I am the eternal flame that shines against the black. The righteous stand together, Supergirl. Kara, to what strange realm do we owe those boots? We shall rain fire and absolution upon those who would serve the black, Sir Harold. Silent sorceress, the house of El and the heralds of Rao honor your sacrifice to restore light to this world. Honor to the house of El. Glory to the heralds of Rao. This power is for the flame. Staring? Why don't you take a picture? It'll last longer. If there's one thing I cannot abide in interplanetary drones, it's rudeness. Focused? Oh, they don't come much more focused than me, Cyborg. Oh, look! A kitten! Yay, Cyborg! We're awesome and it shows. We're smashing scanner drones. When Justice League is on the case, Brainiac's a loser face! Wonder Woman, oh, I've always wanted to fight evil alongside the greatest superhero in the... That's an interesting outfit choice. Hi, Wonder Woman. I've seen all your battles. I follow you online and I refresh the page 50 times a day just to see if you've posted anything new. Too much? Superman had his whole life to get used to his powers before going to high school. I just woke up with my powers when I landed on Earth four weeks ago. What if I fly out that door and run into someone? Or break something? Or my heat vision suddenly? Barbara, you helped me learn how to be super. And look at all the stuff you made. I know you're super in here and in here. Come on, Batgirl. It's time to get our superhero on. There is enough doom and gloom in the air already. And it is better to accept defeat than to take a chance and try like fools to redeem ourselves and save our city and all those who we love there, plus all the people on Earth that this wicked sorceress is going to make suffer just because of us cheers. We could die trying. We won't. We won't. Come on. You can't be kal -El. He's a sweet, chubby baby who laughed when you tickled his feet. You knew me on Krypton? Yeah, I used to watch over you. I don't understand. I mean, I left the planet right after you. We were on the same trajectory. Look, I'm sure you have a lot of questions, but right now we need to find my ship. I do it myself, but those green rocks, they keep weakening me. You don't know what happened after you left. Well, I know we were in the midst of a global civil war led by General Zod. Zorel told me that Krypton's salvation was on Earth, and that you and I were the key. I hope we're not too late. My name is Kara Zorel. I'm from Krypton. I'm a refugee on this planet. I was sent to Earth to protect my cousin, but my pod got knocked off course. And by the time I got here, my cousin had already grown up and become Superman. I hid who I really was, until one day when an accident forced me to reveal myself to the world. To most people, I'm a reporter at CatCo Worldwide Media, but in secret, I work with my adopted sister for the DEO to protect my city from alien life and anyone else that means to cause it harm. I am Supergirl. People don't appreciate just how much I bust my butt. It's not easy to produce a network show, market a skincare line, update my chat every five minutes, and look soups amazing. Still, I feel like I could do more. For people. Maybe. What ends, right? My hair okay? You ever think about how different life would be if we weren't raised in Smallville? Super corny, but I'll second that. Hey, turn it up. I love this one. You ever think about how different life would be if we weren't born on Krypton? I spent decades lost in space, stuck in hypersleep until Adam found my ship. And now I'm cooped up here. Let me out. Diana, you've taught me what my powers can do. This world needs help. Earth's people are so divided. They're always fighting. Well, well what good are these powers if I can't even help Kal-El? I can hear the people down there. All of them. They're afraid, like I was on Krypton when I didn't have these powers. 
And I look at us and I just think we can give them hope.